Hey everybody, so today we have a video of a quilted grid crossbody bag by Lululemon. A couple years ago, I bought this bag, which is the quilted grid belt bag in gray sage. And I actually use it all the time. It's held up very well. I'll have a link to the video in the description if you're interested in seeing a review of this too. Um, so when I saw this bag t pop up, I was like, I gotta give it a try. So it feels even softer than the belt bag version. It feels like a squishy down jacket. So I kind of love it. I'm getting all these hairs from the rug. So the handles are really soft, but I assume they'll be pretty durable. But I kind of worry that maybe it'll start to fray if you carry a lot. But if you don't carry a lot of things, the handles should hold up. Um, it has a plastic zipper in black. I'm not a huge fan of the zipper in being plastic, but I suppose it matches the, the bag, so it does its job there. It's very smooth. Um, inside there's also a pocket, and it's labeled items of importance, which I would probably put my card case or wallet in there. On the other side, it's got two mesh pockets, so you can put other smaller items so you can find them easier. The bag itself is pretty roomy. It can hold quite a bit, which I'll show you what fits in this video as well. It has these two loops here to attach a adjustable crossbody strap that it also comes with. Uh, the bottom here, has got something that looks like leather strips, but I'm not quite sure it's leather really. I think it may be just leather. I'm not really sure. The description on the website doesn't mention anything about being leather, so I'm going to assume it's not. Um, stitching is pretty good. It looks tight. I don't see anything wrong with the stitching here. It looks very tight, very straight. Looks like good quality stitching. Smooth zipper, like that. All right, so let's check out this crossbody strap that it comes with. All right, so these are these little clips that hook onto the loops here. So they snap on just like that, pretty easy. Also have these other loops on the strap that you can attach like those nano backpacks that are really tiny. I have one, but I honestly don't really use it. So it's fully adjustable and you have to... So it's pretty long, I think, but I'm petite, so I have it on a pretty short length. But I'll also have mod shots wearing the bag and I'll include a link to my blog post where I'll show you how it looks on someone who's 4 feet 11 and on the short side. All right, it's a little logo here. Okay, let's see what fits. Sorry, I removed the crossbody straps so it's easier to show what fits in the bag. So this bag doesn't stay up on its own very well. Well, actually now it is, but before it was flopping over. The bottom's not very stiff, so it tends to flop over a lot. Um, the one thing I don't like about this bag is the zipper end here. I kind of feel like it just sticks out and looks a little sloppy. So I kind of like it tucked in for it to be out of the way. All right, so. Let's see, it fits this notebook I have here. It's a moleskine notebook or moleskin, however you want to say it. I'm not really quite sure which is the right way myself. This is a Chanel pouch that I like to carry sometimes. My keys. Inhaler. My AirPods Pro. This pill box that I like to use for my everyday supplements. I'm trying. Um, my card case, I would actually put this in here, in this little zipper pocket, so it's more secure. Extra battery pack 
for my phone. And then for the phone itself, I would probably keep it back here in this outside pocket. So it's easy access and you can also keep it zippered if you want it to be more secure. But if you leave it open, then you can pull it in and out pretty easily. So you can also fit a lot more. See, this is only about half filled. You could probably fit easily sunglass case, maybe even like a small water bottle in here, but then it would get pretty heavy. So then I would worry about how the bag would hold up for being that heavy. But yeah, it fits quite a bit. I do like it a lot. I'm still debating if I want to keep it. I'm not 100% sure. I'm leaning towards yes, because it is very functional and it fits a lot and it's got a lot of zippers. It has uh, mesh pockets here for other things. So it's a zippered inside pocket. So it's overall, it's a very nice design bag. I'm just not a huge fan of this extra piece that just kind of sticks out like that. So yeah, um, if you're interested in seeing some mod shots, I'll link it to my blog post below. There'll be more pictures, but that's it for me. Thanks for listening. Thanks for watching. Take care. See you next time.